Lots of opportunities are being created for broadband providers by consumers' insatiable demand for data, new 5G networks, and the growth in cloud computing. And based on where things are headed, we don't see this trend slowing down anytime soon. Nor do investors. And as a result, they have been busy acquiring mid-sized fiber transport companies at prices that were unthinkable a few years ago. Now that most of the mid-sized companies have been acquired, investors are turning their attention to smaller and rural broadband providers. For smaller and rural companies who are looking to sell, understanding the landscape and developing a plan of action can be overwhelming. Therefore, it's important to understand who the key players are, namely large infrastructure funds, private equity firms, and strategic buyers. It's also important to know what it is investors are looking for. Think fiber-rich networks, operations that are close to Tier 2 and Tier 3 cities, and a track record of cash flow generation, to name a few. Having clearly defined goals is also important. Generally speaking, if the company owners are looking to cash out and remove themselves from the business, selling to a strategic buyer might make sense. Conversely, if they are simply looking to raise equity capital, then partnering with an infrastructure fund might be the best option. Broadband network valuations are high, and it looks like it will remain a seller's market for the foreseeable future. To maximize value, prospective sellers should do their due diligence talking to trusted advisors when they are building their deal team. To find out more, read my report on cobank.com.